All right, yeah, I'm just running over to where uh, the Drake stuff is at. Let's see what it's saying. Yeah, Defense Con is just in the, uh, like, as soon as you land at the space station, you know where there was, like... Yeah, I remember seeing, uh, where the Drake banners were. I'm just going down the elevator now. Might rent one of those caterpillars just so I can check it out. Because I, I have to replace that C2. Um, and I don't know if I want to get another C2 or just, you know, get a different transport. Cutlass reds here, the black, the blue. Oh, the Drake Mule came out. Did you see that little, like, forklift transport vehicle? Oh, uh, yeah, that new little fucking Drake thing. Yeah, it's only like four, It's only like $40 in the shop. And uh, I want to rent one and go check it out. Uh, I'm not sure. I'll go check that out after. I just rented a Caterpillar and one of those Drake, uh, what's it called? The mole or the mule. Oh, they have a javelin commercial down here. This is cool. That's why Drake interplanetary oh, ships that not only provide function and power at a price that we can all afford. But provide peace. Ah, uh, it shows the Kraken too in this ad. Dude. Okay. See the other. Ah. You need to stop me. Ha, <laughs> this is sick, man. It's a commercial for the Kraken, is what it is. It shows it just like flying Defense through ships, blowing them apart. Look at the real ships that are out there yeah. every day, defending your freedom and moving the gears of this empire. Fuck, I'm mad. I was on the website and I didn't see a crack. I gotta go check again. Yeah, I don't see it on there. I imagine they probably all sold out immediately. Can't believe that happened. Where the fuck am I? What happened? Oh my god, I'm at Hurston again! 
I fucking, I went to go on the elevator to that Drake place, and it, like, fucking shot me through the floor, and I died. Oh, ridiculous. But then somehow, I didn't lose my armor. It was all that hurt stuff. Oh, uh, I probably just glitched. You wanna know what happened yesterday? Remember I, I logged off and I was in that winter suit? Yeah. When I logged back in, I woke up in the bed and knew Babbage, and when I got out of bed, he got out the other side of the bed and fell through the building to his death. And I was like, you son of a bitch. Like when he got through the left side of the bed, he went right out the window. It's insane. Isn't it, you need to make the goddamn floor solid. Like, what the fuck? You have to claim another ship to get there. Fucking this mule. Race. I wonder how much inventory this thing has. The forklift on the front of it is meant to contain fortunes. Oh, you can store a container in the rear of it. True. Yeah, all the uh, all the cutlass versions Welcome here. To defense While we cool. Drake into I wish the fucking web act, like the med that was actually good, they not use this now. Yeah. Oh, I see that, I think this is the steel. It has twin door guns, that's amazing. I know, dude, that's the guns that I wanted on the black. Like, why the fuck is the black have this? This is a pretty sick dropship. Kind of light duty, but... Could take a bunch of people. It's just like, I remember Buddy like doing like a thing on it, and he's like, if you and like 14 of your buddies all want to just go and fucking die instantly, there's a ship for you. <laughs> That's what I was laughing about. It's like, I'd rather the Valkyrie to, for transporting people. By yeah, choice. dude, at least it has a little bit of fucking resistance. Now, man, the Drake Herald. I assume this thing must go really fast because if it doesn't, I don't understand the point. I don't even know what that ship is. It's the one that's just a massive engine with a cockpit at the front of it. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think I know what you're talking about. It might have a bit of guns on it, but I'm not. I don't think they're guns that I'm looking at. I'm gonna rent one just so I can go and try it. Would never buy one of these. Oh, it's a medium data runner. So like, it just goes point to point. Oh, they got uh, like merchant stuff for sale. Hilarious that it's like, I can't read it. I'll be back in a few minutes here. I'm still waiting yep. for this fucking thing. I have to go crash and stuff. Hologram of the Kraken. Take a look at the real ships that are out there every day, defending your freedom and moving the gears of this empire. Check this thing out. 
sight. Wow, this Corsair thing is nuts. Defense cons a great opportunity to take a look at the real ships that are out there every day, defending your freedom and moving. dangerous times. That's why Drake Interplanetary builds ships that not only provide function and power at a price that we can all afford, but provide peace of mind for you, for your family. repair ships we've all been there some ship pops up on your scanner and they don't look friendly sure you could try to call local law or the navy but who are you kidding you'll be blown up and picked clean long before they show up stock up on one of drake's versatile combat tested ships and it'll be opportunity to take a look at the real ships that are out there every day defending your freedom and moving the gears of this empire. Welcome to 
<sighs> Man, I'm on this caterpillar and it seems like there is a bunch of uses for this. It has a tractor beam, it has a few different things. It's kind of trippy the layout. It has servers on it. I think they're supposed to make so each section you can like plug and play what you want to do. Yeah, we'll have to check this out a little bit more because it's interesting, that's for sure. I'll meet you up in the lobby and then come down and check everything out because I want to see what you ever think of things. There's an engine terminal station here, so like, you can almost like have something controlling the engines or something too. It seems way more of like the C2 is pure cargo and vehicle. This seems like it has way more use, like or not use, but it's like way more of a cruise ship. Yeah, way more different uh, like game modes basically can be taken advantage of. Yeah, you could do a lot of. Definitely would end up having one of these in the mining for as a How much are they? Uh, I think in game they're four million or something like that. But like in real life they're like three hundred and twenty bucks or something. Sure. Well, that's so, four million sounds pretty good. Yeah, yeah. That's what I mean. I might have to buy one in game over the C two just so I have something different. You need multiple crew for it, which is the weird thing, because C2 has most cargo space, need the least amount of crew. Yeah, I know, it's a weird, weird ship. This, this Caterpillar, I can see it being way more of like, uh, if you have a crew flying this, you're doing multiple different things. You're picking up cargo, yeah. you're picking up data, and in between, you're like salvaging the odd thing or something. And its sides flip down, so like... I have to get a little better look at this, but it looks like you could park almost... five C8X Pisces in it. It's trippy. And I see there's like a vehicle... There's a bunch of turrets on it, but there's like, it looks like you could park a vehicle on it, but it doesn't have a ramp. It's kind of hovering about the ramp, it's kind of weird. It has a docking collar on it. I, 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 like, I would definitely want a pirate version of these, and I would definitely... Yeah. yeah. But I don't want to go in the re arena commander forever. I wish I could survive. Yeah, I think you have to do, like, you have to have, like, two of your buddies and, like, go in there and do this thing where there's, like, ten waves of enemies that come after you. And that does sound kind of fun. We should probably do it at some point. Yeah, I'm not sure if that, like, you get access to that. Like, I know that's how you get the Gladius, but I'm pretty sure, like, that's how you get both. No, I'm looking at this, though, and... This thing should have more cargo space than the C2, in my opinion. And just be slightly redesigned a little bit. Because, uh... It's... It, the C2 is almost unfair, not gonna lie. It's OP as fuck. Yeah, by the looks of this, you can't fit any vehicles in it, unless, like, you can float them in or something. Weird.
I almost, this makes me want to go watch a video on the Caterpillar. Just like somebody who's like a fan of it, who knows everything about it. It does have pretty good defense on it. What? What is it? Uh, I just went uh, to get a Kleenex there. I heard oh. you say, like, I almost... Like, I almost want to watch a video of the Caterpillar just from somebody defense who's a real fan a of the ship to take a look at the because they know everything about it. Every yeah, that's a good idea. It's a cool as fuck ship. It really is. When I think of cargo, this is like I think of this. Such a long ship too, it's huge. We've all been there. Some ship pops up on your scanner and they don't look friendly. Sure, you could try to call local law or the navy. But who are you kidding? You'll be blown up and picked clean long before they show up. Stock up on one of Drake's versatile combat-tested ships, and it'll be the